eventually we will all leave the spirit world and we will be resurrected. Because of Jesus Christ's sacrifice and resurrection, all men and women will be resurrected. That means that our physical bodies will be reunited with our spirit bodies. This time though, our physical bodies will be perfect. There will be no defects and all that our bodies have lost in this life will be restored. All those that have lost limbs, have scars, or even have lost hair shall have it all restored into them again. These bodies will be immortal as well, unlike the mortal bodies that we have here in this world. Therefore we will all live forever without worry of death. Again, this is a free blessing because of the resurrection of Jesus Christ. After we are resurrected, we will be judged by God. Our official judge will be our Savior Jesus Christ. At that moment, we will have a re recollection of all that we have done in this life, and we will be judged to see where we will spend the rest of eternity. We won't necessarily be judged by how many good things we have done compared to how many bad things we have done, but rather we will be judged on the type of person we have become. Have we become like Christ by taking advantage of repentance and his sacrifice, or we have we not tried to follow after our Lord? If we had truly followed our Savior's example in this life, then we would have had a change of heart and sought to live the life that he lived, and that he has desired that we live. All those that were true followers of Christ and his commandments shall be fully rewarded and go to reside where God lives and receive all that he has. Everyone else will go to another place. There are three places that we can be sent to after our judgment. They are called the Celestial, Terrestrial, and the Celestial Kingdoms.